Our first example is to write a function rule using the information in the table. We have a specific number of CDs, 2, 4, 6, 8, or 10 CDs, and we have a cost in dollars based on the number of CDs purchased. We're asked to write a function to describe the cost based on the number of CDs. So if we let our output value, our, our overall cost, be y, then y is going to be equal to the number of CDs times some value. And if we look at the table, we can see that if two CDs is $24, and four CDs is $48, and so on, then each CD must be $12. So the output cost, or the overall cost, is going to be the number of CDs, let's call that x, times $12 per CD. So our function, y equals 12x, describes the cost output y based on the number of CDs purchased, which is the input x. Here we have a word problem that we need to convert to a function. Maya has an internet service that currently has a monthly access fee of $11.95 and a connection fee of $0.50 cents per hour. We need to represent her monthly cost as a function of connect time. So if we let x equal the number of online hours that she has, and y equal her monthly cost, then her monthly cost is going to be that $11.95 connection fee, because that's going to be the same no matter how much time she's online. So $11.95 plus 50 cents per hour multiplied by some number of hours. In this case, we said that was going to be x. So we have plus 50 cents times x hours. So if we convert that just to simple numerical values, we get y equals 11.95 plus 0.5x. And that's going to be our function.